What's up guys, Yoshi Swag HD here, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Black 2 version. Here we are in episode 5, I believe. And in the last episode, we beat the gym leader, Sharon, and we got our basic badge. Our first gym badge in the Unova region, two years later. Um, so yeah, in this episode, we're going to be moving forward and hopefully trying to get to the next city. If we could focus, okay. And here we are talking to, um, what's her face, Bianca, and she's going to give us a TM... 27 return and I'm gonna actually use that on my Riolu because I'm sick and tired of just using uh, What do you call it quick attack and when I put it on my R Riolu actually it boosts up his happiness every time I use it So that'll give it a better chance of evolving sooner. So yeah, but I don't want like a level 14 well 15 uh, Rex the Lucario so Oh yeah, now we have the X-Transceiver, and I believe it's going to be a four-way call, yep, with Professor Juniper, um, myself, Bianca, and Sharon. Cool beans, alright. Okay, and I think she's just talking about how good Sharon's been doing as a gym leader, and uh, yeah. Now, I don't know if you guys know about the whole situation with PETA and Pokemon now they're actually taking on Pokemon it's so stupid they'll just find anybody for support uh, against like video games so first of all they had the Mario game that they ruined and make and made like Super Mario raccoon skinning tail or whatever it was now they've made Pokemon black 3 uh, it's so dumb though they make it like it's pets that are like slaves that's not what Pokemon's about though like Pokemon's about training and like Ah, it makes me so mad though because Pokemon is like the one game that I actually enjoy from N Nintendo. Not that I don't like any other game from Nintendo, but it was like my favorite one. Oh yeah, and here we get the Seagir by the way. And now they're actually dissing it out by making it a PETA situation. So that's pretty dumb, I think. But I'm actually going to go to the Pokemon Center now because I need to heal up. Okay, Bianca, I have to go. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's heal up our Pokemon from the last gym battle. I didn't actually heal off screen because I just started the recording afterwards. So I don't know when this is uploaded, but, um, yeah. We might get, uh, what do you call it? Sidebars in this video, I'm pretty sure we will. If we don't, then my apologies. Uh, I'm still trying to work on them, if they're not there. Mm, because they are quite difficult to make. But yeah, I'm not going to add like any area Pokemon, just the badges, the uh Yeah, the badges, my team. That's pretty much it. Yeah, that's what I think a sidebar is. Oh, and there will be a question of the day, uh like a who's that Pokemon kind of thing. It's going to be pretty fun if I ever get them up. Level 4 Purloin. I remember those days. <laughs> Alright, level 14 Rex the Riolu. It's such a good Pokemon right now. <laughs> Alright, here we are in Flossissi Town, but what we're going to be doing is we're going to be passing on through Flossissi Town because we don't need you anymore. You provided us with Riolus and pink fluffy sheep, but we're out of here now. <laughs> Hey, I'm sorry, I forgot to upgrade the Pokedex that I gave you. I'm going to the habitat list. Uh, it's an amazing feature, blah, blah, blah. It's just going to tell us where our Poke uh, Pokemon are located. So, that's basically what the habitat upgrade is. So, yeah. Would you like to... No! <laughs> I've made that mistake too many times in Japanese version. <laughs> Alright, can I go? God, like, she's probably the most annoying person in this game so far. Alright, well here we are on Route 20, and uh, we already face these trainers, so we can just pass by. Oh, and now we have our first gym badge, we can go through here, but I believe he's going to want to challenge us. Yep, he will. <laughs> Hiker Jerome. But you know what, I think we're going to actually end off this episode by getting into the city. And then... Uh, I'm going to start off the next episode catching ourselves a new Pokemon, and then we'll be trained up and ready to go against the next gym leader, Roxy, the poison type gym leader.
Alright, and here we are. We just beat the Riolu that this trainer had. And we get 150 XP. Beautiful. Just a breeze. And we're going to have a cutscene here with uh, our rival Hugh. Please tell me this is Pokemon Battle. Yes! I just want to keep on training my Pokemon so much because um, I know that Piggett evolves at level 17. And if I get to my Pokemon to like level 21 by we get to the gym leader, that'll be great because I think the highest level is 21. And yeah, it'll just be a great day in history. Sorry if you saw my thumb there, I was just too lazy to move the cursor. Or that D pad, sorry. Alright, quick attack once again. Just taking up these Psyducks. Well, again. I'm starting to think that Riolu's just kind of a boss right now. This I, I haven't checked his nature yet. I'll have to look at it. Force Palm, yes! I think I'll forget Endure for that. Yes! Oh, you don't know, guys, how much I've been waiting for that move. That, that I could use that so much in the gym leader. Because then he would be tanking everybody. Whoa, you're two levels higher? Dude, get in there. <laughs> okay, and here we go with cutscene with... Oh, it was Charon and Hugh. Okay. So yeah, he's going to show us about this Dark Grass. The Dark Grass, you can actually have double battles. And now that we have two Pokemon in our party, we can now have double battles. So that's pretty cool. If you came here with only one Pokemon, then you wouldn't be able to uh, battle double battles. If you went in there, it would just be a uh, regular one battle. One v one Pokemon. Okay, guys, let's continue on here. Now, he's just going to talk to us about Team Plasma. Uh, I don't think we actually know about Team Plasma yet. <laughs> Fill up my Pokedex, he said. Okay, so yeah, we're just going to take on this trainer. There are a couple of trainers here in this little route. There's about uh, two, three more. Well, I, I say three because one's a double battle, so... Yep. Okay. Soon, I believe that Piggett's gonna want to learn, uh, what do you call it? Flame Charge, so that'll be good. 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 Because <laughs> when it learns Arm Thrust, wait, Flame Charge, sorry, uh, it'll be a higher move of Ember, but I'll still keep Ember for, like, the lower firing attacks. Like, if it has, like, 10 HP, I'll just use Ember instead of wasting my Flame Charge. And then when it evolves, it learns, what do you call it? Uh, it learns arm thrust, so then you get good. That's a that's a good fighting move that you use. So yeah, there's an item over there. I'm just gonna get it afterwards. There's an item over there too. I think I'll get that though. All right. Nursery. I didn't even read that. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Dunsparce is probably the most annoying Pokemon in Japanese version. Oh my god, you don't know how annoying it was for me. <sighs> it was actually really, 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 really annoying. I, It took me like 10 minutes just to battle it because it kept on using this move. Um, that would like... Bleh, bleh, heal itself. <laughs> oh no! Don't use rollout. It's not good. Don't use rollout. Don't kill him. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Why is Piggett like the, the worst guy now? Piggett was awesome. <sighs> I guess we'll just have to go heal him up. And train him. Holy crap. Well, now the double battle is just going to be a single battle, but I don't, I'm going to go back and heal. We're actually coming to a close soon. I want to end it off because I want to film another one eventually. Because I want to put a lot, out a lot of these. Not a lot of people are actually doing English version, so... Because they've already, like, completed Japanese version and they just think it's a waste, pretty much. <laughs> But, and I totally agree with that, but...
I'm just doing English version. Alright, hello, welcome to the Pokemon server. Hello, and welcome to- I can't believe I actually read the text to that. I'm pretty sure you guys all know what that says by now. Alright, ten minutes in. Okay, just turn up the volume on the game. Alrighty, so let's go back and face those trainers. Piggett, you gotta do a better job, because Rex is tanking, and but I want you to evolve. <laughs> Okay, don't run into any Pokemon here, please. Oh, last grass. Sunturn. Ooh. That'll be a good addition to my Pokedex. Not my team. I... I don't really like Sunturn very much. But if you are looking to fill up your Pokedex, definitely catch it. Maybe train it up a little bit. Evolve it. I don't even know if it has an evolution. <laughs> I've never used it on my team, ever. But yeah. Okay. Send him a dire hit. I never use these dire hits or these X accuracies. Leave a comment if you use them. I, I know I don't. It's just, I just kind of think it's a waste. Okay, double battle, right? All right. Well, we're all good. Okay. Let's see how good these little trainers are. Leah and Lily. Hello, Leah and Lily. Sun current. Okay, this should be good XP for and easy to kill for Piggett. So, Piggett, I'm gonna use, uh, I'm gonna make you use that and don't use Foresight, okay? Use Quick Attack on that Sun current. Whoops. <laughs> and there goes that Sun current with Umber. Oh, I can't believe it's like only 30 HP. What am I talking about? <laughs> XP. Wow, that was a critical hit. <laughs> okay, let's just hit it with a tackle. It'll die either way. Alright, you're dead, Sunfern. Have a nice day. No, you're not getting another level, Rex. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Well, and I believe we're heading into the next town now. Whoops. What does this lady want? Oh, Great Balls. Cool. So we can catch Pokemon at a higher rate. Sorry, I don't know what's going on with this camera right now. I can't wait till like, it's still like full screen so then I can actually see what happened. Okay. Whoa, that's what happened. That's cool. Of course, as soon as I take a step, it's from Mom. Yep, I'm in the Verbank City, Mom. Big city. <laughs> she wants me to visit the Verbank Complex. Okay, well, I'll visit that. Oh, and uh, here's a little cutscene, so... Yep. Don't try to stop me. I'm off to Pokestar Studios to live up my true potential. My dream is to ship captain, to be a ship captain and a movie star. Get real, you're a captain already, aren't you? If that ship doesn't move, you're going to cause lots of trouble. Oh dear daughter, you split your time between your responsibilities as a gene leader and with your band, right? I can do that too. So I guess that's Roxy's father. Ah, you dim-witted, dense, dumb, daft, dippy, dork, doltish doofus. <laughs> that's a lot. Alrighty guys, well thanks so much for watching. I'm gonna end it off here. Thanks so much for watching, just said that, and see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and like for more Pokemon Black and White too. So yeah, bye.